So in this demo now, we want to take a closer look at the Teams integration using Power Virtual Agents. We saw the approval um, integration already before, but now we want, really want to talk about um, an integration via a chatbot that allows me to connect to an SAP system and retrieve live data from this SAP system. So here, for example, I can just um, specify or write that I need to look up some additional um, product information from the SAP system. I'm prompted to specify the product ID, and now I get the live data back from the SAP system. Obviously, there could be additional questions and stuff like that, but, but here you can see that I can actually connect this. The powerful thing is that I can create this bot very, very easily directly from within Teams. I don't need to open up a new prog product or, or something like that. I can do this all from within Teams. So here in Power Virtual Agents, I have already created my chatbot um, and we'll take a look at this um, specific chatbot here. So the starting point are the so-called topics. Um, topics are um, areas um, that the chatbot can interact with. So for example, there's a greetings topics and depending on the um, the trigger word, hello, good morning, um, good day or, or whatever, um, this um, specific topic will be triggered. So if we take a look at the um, authoring canvas, then you can see that once one of these trigger um, phrases are detected, then I can write some welcome messages. Another topic that we have here is a topic that I've created called um, Get Products from SAP. And I've also supplied some trigger phrases, um, product info, show me products from um, SAP. And if these trigger phrases are triggered, then I'll um, prompt the user, well, let's take a look at the products. What are the um, product IDs that you're interested in? And the result is stored then in this variable use product ID. Now the real powerful thing of this integration comes into place because um, we can just leverage the very same Power Automate functionalities that we also looked um, used before when looking at the updating the price or creating new product in the SAP system. This is just another way where we call this Power Automate flow. And you'll see in a second that for me as an end user, it's really, really very, very easy. In our specific case, I just need to provide the product ID. So you can see here in this case, the trigger is the Power Virtual Agents, but then we have this very familiar get product functionality, which connects to the SAP system, providing the product ID. And as a result, I get the name, the description and the price. Obviously this could be much more elaborate. I could get additional functionalities, but here, I have this one input field, product um, ID, and then as a result, I get product name, description, and price back from the SAP system. I can take these variables and write them back um, in a message. So with this, there's not much that needs to be done. So I can just um, click on publish, and this chatbot is then available as a tile um, or as a functionality for the end users. Obviously, if I have the required permissions, to do this publishing also to other users. And then I can just interact with SAP directly from Teams.